All right, just in breaking news massive attack on Tel Aviv and Gaza's official statement. All right, we bombed Tel Aviv with a missile barrage in response to the Zionist massacres against civilians. Hamas. Large explosion rocked the city of Tel Aviv following a large missile attack from North Gaza. Source Al Jazeera. Please, before I proceed to this commentary, please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on my Facebook and Instagram page, and then on my TikTok page. All right. Hamas official statement. We demand all the world's forces to end the occupation of our land and our outcurs. We are ready to pay the price for freedom and will not accept anything less than our independence. We had information that the aggression would return to Gaza after the civilian prisoners exchange operation. There will be no prisoner exchange as long as the aggression continues on Gaza. We are in a battle of liberation and the occupier must leave our land. We have proposed the handover of the elderly over 60 years in exchange for the release of our prisoners over 60. Efforts are ongoing and our brothers in Qatar are exerting effort to curb the Israeli aggression on Gaza. The ruling class in the Zionist entity has an interest in continuing the aggression because once it stops, its rule will end and Netanyahu will go to prison. The resistance led by Hamas is steadfast in Gaza and we are certain that the Palestinian people will expel the occupation. Every Israeli crime against our people hastens the end of the occupation. I salute our brothers in Lebanon, Iraq and Yemen and we call on all Arab and Islamic countries to fight the occupation. An Arab state reviving the leader of Zionist entity at this time is difficult for us, illogical, and we are against normalization with the occupation. Please don't forget to like, comment, and share. Follow me on my Instagram page, follow me on my Facebook page, and then subscribe to my YouTube channel for more. Thank you.